Thursday marked the fifth anniversary of the US drone program and the latest numbers show at least 2,400 people have died from the unmanned aerial vehicles. As the Bureau of Investigative Journalism notes, President Obama has been using drone strikes to fight terrorists since the third day he took office. And the use of drone strikes have skyrocketed under Obama. While reported deaths were only in the hundreds under George W. Bush, thousands of deaths have been tallied under the current president. Jen, uh, is, is there any sign that this controversy is, is, is coming to a head, that there might be tighter restrictions on exactly how we use drones? drones? It's kind of understandable that, that Obama would use more than Bush because the technology has been skyrocketing and advancing at a, a pace. But where's the debate on this? Yeah, it's, this is one of those issues that the, the White House is just kind of stuck on, that, that there's not much movement in changing the program. And you're right that there does seem to be more, a lot more use of, the, of drones in part because the technology is just much better than it was even five to ten years ago. It's always advancing. So, I mean, the only thing that the administration has offered to do was to try to transfer the drone program from the CIA to the Pentagon. But that required congressional approval, and it was they didn't approve it. So, mm. for now, it looks like the drone program is staying in place, and the numbers are going to keep going up of casualties. They're probably going to increase... Uh, Exp at least like doubling. I mean, they're going to go up more exponentially than they have been just because they're going to be, there's better technology and there's just more use of drones. So I don't really see how this is going to change, anything's going to change with this program at this point. It's just going to, we're just going to keep watching the casualties picking up.